In the vast expanse of Greek mythology, where gods and goddesses frolic among mortals and meddle with their affairs, there exists a cluster of ancient deities known as the primordial Greek gods. These divine beings, born from the chaos of the cosmos, set the stage for the Olympian pantheon with their cosmic powers and mischievous antics. They were the original trendsetters, the cosmic influencers, if you will, and their stories continue to captivate and amuse even the most sophisticated minds. Let's start with Chaos, the OG matriarch of the primordial gods. Picture Chaos as a swirling abstract art masterpiece that embodies the swirling confusion that was the early universe. From Chaos sprang forth Gaia, the Earth, and Uranus, the sky. And here's where the cosmic family drama takes center stage. Gaia and Uranus got together, as one does when you're a personified Earth and sky, and produced a brood of divine children who would eventually become the gods and goddesses we all know and love. But let's not forget about Tartarus, the gloomy and abyssal void beneath the Earth. It's the underworld's cool, mysterious cousin. Tartarus is like the black hole of Greek mythology, swallowing up the most despicable titans and other unruly creatures. You know you're dealing with some serious cosmic depth when even Zeus, king of the Olympians, wouldn't dare venture too close. Now let's shine a spotlight on Eros, the god of love and desire. Eros is the original Cupid, armed with a mischievous grin and an arsenal of heart-shaped arrows. With a flick of his bow, he could make even the most stoic warrior fall head over heels in love. But be warned, love isn't always roses and poetry. It can be a bit like Greek mythology itself, full of twists, turns, and unforeseen consequences. One of the standout characters in the primordial pantheon is Nyx, the goddess of the night. Nyx was like the ultimate nocturnal party planner, orchestrating the dance between darkness and dreams. When the sun set, she'd unleash her magical nocturnal creatures, from sleep-inducing hypnos to the ghostly specters of dreams and nightmares. Nyx knew that sometimes it takes a little darkness to appreciate the light. And then there's Erebus, the personification of darkness and shadow. Erebus was like the celestial curtain casting an enigmatic veil over the cosmos. He was the embodiment of that mysterious shadow lurking just out of sight, reminding us that even in the brightest of times, darkness can still hold its allure. You know what they say, every light needs a little shade to truly shine. As we reflect on the primordial gods, we see that they were not only symbols of cosmic power, but also mirrors of human existence. They embodied the complexities of love, the allure of the night, and the hidden depths within us all. Their stories, woven with humor and wisdom, remind us of the universal truths that transcend time and culture. So let us raise our goblets of nectar to these cosmic tricksters, these divine jesters who danced upon the celestial stage. Their playful antics and profound influence shaped the mythology we cherish today. Without their cosmic contributions, the world would be as bland as an eternal cloudy day. And thus, as the primordial gods continue to inspire and bewilder us, we are reminded that life is a cosmic tapestry, woven with threads of chaos, love, darkness, and light. In the grand theater of existence, let us embrace the divine shenanigans and find joy in the thought-provoking journey they offer. For in their cosmic tales lies a treasure trove of wonder and enlightenment. Congratulations, fellow myth enthusiasts. You've embarked on an extraordinary journey through the realms of Greek mythology with us. But hold on tight, because the adventure is far from over. In our next thrilling episode we'll dive even deeper into the captivating tales that have bewitched humanity for centuries. From epic battles to divine love affairs, from cunning heroes to vengeful gods, each story promises to leave you hungry for more.